Good, 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 good food eating. Yeah. Hi, I'm Paul, and today we're going to make my famous chicken schnitzel. One, ready to go? We're going to bang it out now and give it a bit of a smash. Always good to put it in a bag. Make sure that that side's up, the um, open side, not the closed side, so that way you'll be able to bang it a bit. Knock it down. Okay, so there's our chicken. Nice and thin. Doubled in size. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to get two eggs into a bowl. Just going to whisk that up with a fork. A little bit of salt and pepper. Okay, next we've got our uh, coconut flour and our almond meal. And not breadcrumbs, remember that. Okay, so we're going to put our chicken in there just to get a nice skin on it. Put it in like this and make sure it's submerged. This is the fun part. Let the three-year-olds do this and you're going to have a lot of fun. And then we're going to put it in here and we're going to turn that over. Look at that. And I'll just push a few crumbs in there. Now we're replacing the breadcrumbs with almond meal. So this is going to, um, this is great. So, you know, we, we don't have to eat bread in this diet. It's a wonderful thing. I'll move it over. And on there. So there we go. Doesn't that look good? Okay, now we've got our pan nice and hot. I'm going to put some oil in. I want to put a little bit, a fair bit in because the crumbs are going to absorb a little bit of this. I want to get it really hot because I want to seal the crumbs quickly. But just wait, got to be patient. If you put it in too early, your schnitzel's going to go all soggy. Here we go, now I'm going to put it in. If you give it a little bit of a shake when you go in, it won't stick. Just keep it moving a little bit, it's good. You can see that my chicken fillet is quite thin, so hopefully uh, it's going to cook before the crumbs burn. So I think that's about ready to turn over. Okay. But it's all right, it's going to be good. Now, I just turned that heat down a bit because on this side, you just don't, now, now you want to actually cook it more through. See, we've got a presentation side there we can use. But now, turning it over, that's going to put more heat through the bottom end. Should take about, oh, I reckon, four minutes. Four minutes will do five minutes to do it, you know, depending on how thick it is. Put that on there, just to get the, um, drain it off. Just make sure you don't do it on the sports section, or you're going to be in trouble. Give that a pat, that gets the oil out, and now we're ready to serve. I've just served it up. I'm going to have uh, some salad with uh, schnitzel and a little bit of my mayonnaise with tomato uh, sauce in it. See you later. It's Paul from the Inside the Patio Kitchen, and I hope I catch up soon. I'm going to eat lunch. I'm just about to have a breakdown. See ya. Good, 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 good food eating. Yeah.